I'm really passionate about energy and creating a world in which energy is cheap and easily available and is also widely accessible. So my research is on inorganic mechanistic chemistry. The idea is to build air breathing batteries or fuel cells that utilize the atmospheric oxygen. To see if we can... To do that, you need to build these oxidation catalysts that use oxygen to react with the fuels. And to do this electrochemically rather than combusting the fuel. So when you combust the fuel, you waste a lot of energy. But if you oxidize the fuel electrochemically, you will increase the efficiency because you're not wasting energy as heat. You want to be able to bind atmospheric oxygen and use it to accept electrons. What drew me to Notre Dame was the ability to work with intelligent professors. Dr. Brown and I share a very intellectual relationship, and we have so many teaching moments every day. I feel very lucky to work with him. As an inorganic chemist, I use a lot of nuclear magnetic resonance instrumentation. We have five instruments on campus. Most universities have one, and we can just go in there and use it any time. Usually you can spend a month waiting in line, so there's really no barricades in our research because of instrumentation. There's C2 symmetry, but the ligands are not symmetrical. Notre Dame gives you this great opportunity, both through the department and funding that's available through the university. I recently attended a Gordon conference in Texas, and it's a very selective conference. Only, I think, six or eight graduate students were allowed, and the rest of it was all professors, and I got to meet with Nobel laureates and talk with them about my research. It was $1,000 to attend the conference, and the graduate school just gave it to me. It was like, you know, this is a fabulous opportunity. You can go attend. Notre Dame allows you to reach for your dreams. It allows you to follow that passion. There's no place like Notre Dame.